Athabasca University is Canada's preeminent online and distance post-secondary institution. Over the past two years, with funding from the Government of Canada's Knowledge Infrastructure Program, or KIPP as it's commonly known, we've made major improvements to our learning and research facilities, both physical and virtual. This funding has helped us to cement our position as a leader in the growing field of distance education and as a world-class research institute. We focused our KIPP funding on two key areas, renewing our physical campus in Athabasca and expanding our virtual open knowledge environment. At the Athabasca campus, we doubled the size of our science lab. We can now run uh, lab sessions here uh, for up to 20, 25 students using state-of-the-art high-tech equipment. Some students who had been here before actually complimented us to a tremendous change that we have thanks to this funding now. In addition to that, we also have our research space, several research labs that are used by researchers in different disciplines. My name is Ken Manikura and I'm a geologist. The main thrust of my research focuses on reconstructing environmental change that has taken place in Western Canada over the last 20,000 years using records from geological materials. Here I'm carrying out what we call grain size analysis. Results of grain size analysis help investigators determine how the sediment was deposited. The funding that we received for this has made all the difference for us. Our open knowledge environment is our Information and Communications Technology, or ICT. Over 38,000 students, 1,300 faculty and staff, and 350 partner institutions use our ICT services every day from locations all over the world. A strong ICT infrastructure is vital to our work, and thanks to the 35 ICT projects supported with KIPP funding, we now provide better services with greater speed and security to all members of the Athabasca University community, no matter where they are. It was extremely important in us achieving our open knowledge environment and improving our uh, IT infrastructure within Athabasca. One of the really important technical achievements was the virtual desktop. And what this has allowed us to do is to provide a virtual environment for all our stakeholders, particularly the tutors initially. Um, this will allow them to receive our services in a safe and secure environment and one which we can upgrade on a regular basis, making sure that they have the best that we can give them at any point in time. We're competing in, in a global economy and online education is not local, it's global and we must compete on that basis and KIPP has put us in that place. Removing barriers to learning and sharing and advancing knowledge is what Athabasca University is all about. The investment in our research and learning facilities through the Knowledge Infrastructure Program has improved our ability to meet our mandate. Athabasca University, meeting the challenges of today's learners and tomorrow's knowledge economy.